Brad Thibodeau joining us again for another Medicare Monday. Brad, thanks for being here. Yes, thanks for having me. Unfortunately, we are talking about scams today because that happens everywhere. Phone calls, emails, things like that. How can we tell if a Medicare scam is in fact a scam? Well, you know, we all hate to say scam, but but the truth is that, you know, a lot of these phone calls that are coming in, um, it's just uh, not in the best interest of a client, you know, and uh, I would have to say that that's considered a scam. And so um, be, be very cautious about phone calls, um, you know. All important information is going to come through the mail, mm -hmm. and so just be cautious, you know. But could we even find that in the mail as well? And what do we do in that case if it comes through the mail? Well, you know, I go around telling folks to, to check their mail and, and really pay attention to their mail. So yeah. it, it is important to pay attention to it. Uh, but, you know, if it's not coming from Medicare, Social Security, um, directly from the Medicaid office um, or, you know, insurance information but in particular with your member id number your personal information then just be very cautious because you know they're uh, trying to get folks through the mail as well you know and also other benefits can be enticing you mentioned to me earlier a free grocery card should somebody decide on a plan solely because of that benefit no, they should not. I mean, you know, health care is what this is all about. And so if we can have access to the best health care, you know, that's what we're trying to do. But, you know, no doubt it's very enticing. You know, um, some of these plans offer a, a, a substantial amount of, of over the counter, you know, healthy food type benefits. So just again, be careful, but keep in mind the most important thing is health care. So yeah. you got to get that plan selection, you know, right. And some people even decide on their plans, they sign up for a Medicare plan, and then they are getting these solicitations after the fact. Is there a way to stop that or avoid it? No, no. Well, if you can figure it out, let me know. But, uh, but no, it's, it's unavoidable. It's happening, you know, every day, and it's, it's sad. Uh, but, you know, you, we can be contacted and, uh, you know, if you have questions, give us a call and, and you know, Thibodeau Family Agencies is, is wanting to help our seniors. And so uh, we were going to be honest, you know, if someone is in a, a good plan, if that's the best plan for them to be in, we are going to be honest, you know, and, and advise them to stay right where they're at. Yeah, so we can't always avoid these scammers, but the important thing is to just be informed on uh, sort of how to not fall into these traps. And that's where the Thibodeau Family Agency can help. You guys have a QR code that we can scan, a website, a phone number. We'll have all of that contact information on the screen for you. Again, Medicare Monday with Brad Thibodeau and the Thibodeau Family Agency.